Hi Cancer, this is Shah and this is your romance reading for October 2020. I hope you're having a love you've had a lovely month and I hope you're having a wonderful week. Please do take a look at your general readings as the in in the introduction there's some news and some new things are happening so have a look in the uh, weekly introduction okay I'm using the transparent tarot as, uh, tarot as well and I'm using the kingdom tarot of the kingdoms and I'm using TLC for the soul and the answer of the angels so let's get started the first uh, card we have is the king of pentacles so everything you touch will turn out positively will turn to gold as they say you could also be meeting a, 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 a Taurus but don't exclude Virgo or Capricorn either because they are her earth signs but the king is the first house and the first house is Taurus so you could be meeting one of them but definitely more likely a Taurus then we have the lovers and the lovers well you are meeting your soulmate or you have met your soulmate or you're hooked up with your soulmate and you feel totally in balance this could be a Gemini if you're not hooked up you could also be meeting a Gemini perhaps May and June were, is a significant time for you uh, perhaps you met your Virgo Taurus or Gemini in that time and you're beginning to realize that you've met your soulmate what I do is layer it and look he's offering you something tangible it could be a proposal that you are getting from your partner the Sun is behind him and he's in the spotlight so he could be making you, you an offer and the world the world is his oyster and that is you you are his world or her world women can propose nowadays as well you don't have to hang around <laughs> and wait for her, your prospective partner to propose okay then we have the five of swords and all uh, several of these swords are broken be careful what you say and how you act or react to this proposal it could be money but it could also be a proposal of marriage it's something tangible du for uh, uh, with uh, durability and for long term so don't squabble and don't fight if you don't want to get married say gently thank you can I think about it don't keep them in suspension too long and don't go into a fight okay because then it will be over and out nobody's the winner here with the five of swords there will only be a broken hearts then you have the ten of earth so this could be a money offer from somebody as well could be from your partner as you've got the ten of pentacles but the ten of pentacles means inheritance happy family life extending the family life perhaps moving home um, also getting an inheritance or a gift so the gift is on its way so don't worry cancer okay now we're going to put the five of swords on top of the ten of pentacles look something is sprouting new uh, uh, new this is like a flower opening up something is birthing okay because ten is also an ending and where there is an ending there is a new beginning perhaps in the past you might have had words and they went back and thought about it and now it's coming in something is birthing a new beginning in the third week you have the ace of cups cancer and your cup is running over this could be emotions but this could also be the money as you have the lovers 
and it's depicted with the sun and the world. The world is your oyster as I said at the beginning of October so be careful what you say and what you do but I also hear be careful what you pick because it will bring in rediment for long term. Perhaps you might go into care, working in the care, being a receptionist, being an, uh, um, an auxiliary nurse or a carer. Okay, that will you might even I think you m if you aim high, like a manageress or a manager, you could even become that because we've got the king here. That could be also the offer, if you are not hooked up. Uh, or whether you are hooked up, there is a Cancer, Scorpio, or a Pisces in your uh, around your Cancer that you could meet up somebody caring, nurturing, loving, but also passionate, sensual, and sexy, and very telepathic, and somebody very spiritual, somebody that is has their emotions under control but is a very feeling, sensitive, loving person. This could be a woman or a man. If you're a man, this could be a woman for you. If you're a woman, this could be a man coming in. Like I said, you might have had a squabble with somebody and it was over. Don't worry about it um, because you are getting the warning to watch out what you do and what you say and how you react on a proposal because the world is your oyster so even if you are not married yet but you're going out with somebody it might go up a notch okay so this can be with a Taurus Gemini and now a Cancer Scorpio or Pisces you've got the six of air and the six of air as we all know is the six of swords you are moving away from rough waters. Look at the waters being rough. Well, I also see it as air. The wind is blowing. The gales are past. Okay, the gales have gone. The rough waters have gone. This is Pegasus flying into softer, gen uh, gentle air, and also because of the cup is here. It is will be quite. It can be emotional. You you might be elated, so happy that the troublesome or cumbersome time is past. Things will only get better. Your cup is overflowing. You don't have to cry any longer. You might be moving home, or you might be going on a well-deserved holiday. For perhaps honeymoon if this is a proposal of marriage then this could be the honeymoon you are happy you could be crossing water as well even if it's from one town to the next you might be driving across a bridge where water passes underneath to top it all you have the wheel of fortune in the fourth week but remember it can also be the energy all around the the the, moon, uh, the month, but the third week is the twenty fourth uh, first, and we're going into Scorpio. Okay, so we are going in water into the water sign again, element, and so you might be extra sensitive there. So be careful by not making rows or quarrels. What comes round goes round. What goes up must come down. This is also my karma card. If you've done wrong or good, you'll get it back threefold, definitely. And especially with the golden touch, the Midas touch, and the Ten of Pentacles here. It's looking financially, it's looking good. There could be a new job that you're passionate about, and you're going to take it. You're going to fly high. Okay. You're leaving troubled, difficult times behind. This is your karma card, and you'll get it back threefold. There you go. Three good things happening. Wow. And again, the Wheel of Fortune also means home, moving home, or going on holiday. 
this also means going up to the next level in a friendship or a relationship if you are going out you might become engaged or you might be moving in or they might be moving in it could also mean uh, if you're engaged you might be getting married like I said a proposal it looks more like a proposal because he's holding reaching out you have the four of cups make sure that you look at you are conscious what is happening around you don't get depressed and don't get stuck in your head be aware of what is happening around you there's so many things happening here and so many changes don't get flustered don't get scared if you're scared then ask for help okay to make the wheel turn up right for you because you're in the wheel you're going up and away right awesome so if you aren't hooked up you might meet somebody this month that will become your soulmate or feel like your soulmate right from the first word go you are ready that is the answer of the angels now your soul story and we've got stepping stones here across the lake and I said you might be crossing water take one step at a time don't rush okay rush and you have to do things in hurry and you have to repent in leisure now let's see what this card says this is a moment of expansion there you go the ten of pentacles the moment of expansion going higher or bigger to be reassured that you are going to flourish before you put faith into your inspirations conversely the way of wisdom is asking you to take a chance by applying all that you've recently learned in all your life's studies toward this moment of opposition bring your most valuable lessons whether or not they stem from love or regret and disappointment call upon patience open-mindedness there you go don't get stuck in your mind and flexibility to aid you in seeing a new perspective in your soul's story there you go let's have a look be empathic okay an empathic approach brings harmony while the sharpness of righteousness can leave a bitter sting there you are that's the five of swords and your cup is going to run over resist the desire to shrink back and you will receive the reward of your own of your own magnificence being revealed to you and with it the a proposition of exciting new circumstances the proposition the proposal that is so awesome it's coming together this reading is short but strong it's got a strong message get ready be careful how you react and what you say walk away from other people's drama rise above it like Pegasus okay this is Pegasus rise above it leave the rough waters behind you and carry on to smoother quieter waters if you walk away from it and rise above it you'll go to quieter waters and you'll get your karma in due course okay so take walk away from drama and quarrels but I don't I think that you've got this warning and I think you've learned from the past if you don't want something then just say very gently no thank you 
and if you want to take a pro this proposal then say yes thank you but let's take it one step at a time you need building blocks to m maintain a proper foundation okay so take the time out to think but don't get depressed or sad don't get stuck in your head and that's what I mean ask for help if you can't decide don't be scared or shy I hope you have enjoyed this reading cancer take care and please be safe and enjoy your month uh, of October and I hope it resonates with you if it doesn't resonate then have a look at your moon sign or your rising sign take care my sweeties please share and like thank you